Hey guys, Dave from the Centurions Review. What I have here, I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, uh, Comancheria, I think is the correct pronunciation. It's a game about the Comanches. Uh, it says it's from Joel Tappan. It's from GMT Games. I want to thank them for sending me a copy to review. And let's see the back side. It says complexity. Let me zoom in there so you can see a little bit better. Complexity of four, solitaire suitability of nine, so it's perfectly suitable for solitaire gaming. Looks like it's got a point-to-point -point map. It says it's a solitaire game which transports players back to a time when prairie grass was yet to be trodden by wagon wheels. Back to a time when the bison herds numbered in the millions. Back to a time when the Comanche were the lords of the southern plains. You, the player, get to make the key decisions as you guide your people in an epic conquest of the Southern Plains. As a player, you must balance carefully the establishment of your people's culture against the relentless pressure of an increasingly hostile colonial enemy. So it sounds interesting. Never played anything like that. Let's open it up and see what it looks like inside. I think the author of this uh, runs a Facebook group. I think it's, uh, I can't remember the name of it. I think the Facebook group is for selling war games. Alright, let's see what we got in here. All sorts of decks. Let's see here, a culture deck. History cards, war column movements, so these must be controlling the AI or something, horsemanship, Lord of the Plains, politics, tactics, let's see this development deck. Santa Fe Trail, Louisiana Purchase, Smallpox epi Epidemic, Kiowa Alliance, little they know a, a nice little helicopter would be named after them, Comancheros, those were New Mexicans who were licensed to trade with the Comanches inside uh, Comancheria, interesting. Civil War Buffalo Hunters. Let's see what this other thing is here. Development deck number two. Apache War Disease. Spanish Trade and Bombardo, Embargo. San Sara Mission. What else do we have here? Nuevo Apacheria. And Comanche Moon, interesting. And it looks like we have a bunch of little plastic bags for storing components. Here's the rules. Full color, 23, 24 pages. Sequence of play is until page nine, interesting. Resolving enemy instructions. So it's like some kind of player aid or something. So that's in color. That's that's good. All right. So this is like the standard player aid card here, and it's got a playbook, just like Fort Sumner and uh, what was that other one that had a playbook that I tried, uh, Labyrinth. Looks like this is a tutorial and designer notes. Tutorial is always a good idea in the game. Alrighty. And let's take a look here down at the counters. Oh, this is nice. Some of the counters are shaped as hexes. That's kind of cool. Some are circles, some are squares. Let me zoom out a little bit. 
I even got counters representing bison, horses, captives, guns, food, medicine. Interesting. All right, the map is mounted. That's good. It's a good size map. It's real good size map. Let me pan out a little so you can see it. Interesting. Look forward to trying this. Let's see what else is in the box. Looks like the last thing is three dice. So this looks interesting. It's got a big rule book, but could be a fun game, so I will give it a shot, play it solo a bunch of times, and post a review about it. Thanks for watching, and if you guys like this video, click like on the video, and please subscribe to this channel. Thank you. Have a good evening.